right, let's finish up this brunch with a beautiful cocktail, but we're gonna make it a mocktail so everyone can participate. But at the end of this mocktail, I'm going to be topping it with a little sparkling water. If you choose to do champagne, mamas out there, you go ahead and you add some champagne to this. But we're gonna do a beautiful sangria here. So in this pitcher right here, I have orange juice. I put about a cup of orange juice in there. And now I'm gonna add in some sliced fruit. That's one of my favorite parts about sangria is you really feel healthy when you're drinking it. It's basically a smoothie. So you just drink away if you feel like it. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and add in some fresh sliced orange into this. I'm also gonna get some apple. I only need a little bit of apple here. Just some beautiful slices. It always looks beautiful when you put a couple slices in your glass as well. And I'm gonna do a half a lemon here as well. And what I love about this, for anyone who's out there making this for the special mom in your life, you can make this ahead of time and just have it in the fridge nice and cold, ready to go, and then just top it with the sparkling right before you need it. So I'm gonna add in, we got the orange juice. We're gonna do a cup of apple juice in here as well. And then I'm gonna do some pomegranate cherry juice, pomegranate raspberry juice, pomegranate, whatever kind of pomegranate juice you like, cherry, any, any of the pomegranate juices. But we're gonna get in, that in there for some beautiful color. There we go. And then I'm gonna give this a good stir, get all that orange juice from the bottom, let that fruit kind of marinate in there. Beautiful. And then right before we serve it, right before we serve it, we're gonna go ahead and add in either champagne for the adults or just some sparkling water. You can also do sparkling apple juice in this. It's absolutely delicious. But this is just gonna give it that fun little zhuzh, that little fizz you need off the top here. Give that a little stir and then we can get that served up. Isn't that pretty? Keep that in your fridge. Get ahead, make it the night before if you want to. Get it ahead of the gang. So now, let's go over everything we did today. We've got our beautiful sangria. We're gonna move that over. Next, let's do, what was the first thing we did here? The potatoes, don't forget the roasted potatoes are so delicious and it's got that Wyoiga Star feta sauce on the bottom, gorgeous. Now, that bacon, I told you about that bacon. I told you it was gonna turn into candy, look at this. <laughs> it's just thick and sugary and spicy and I would literally be eating this right now on camera but it's got a little heat to it, no one needs to see that from me. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that down. Uh, don't forget about our beautiful fruit salad and that lemon, or that lime poppy seed honey dressing, bright and gorgeous. And then of course we've got our French toast sticks, made in the waffle maker, little maple syrup on the side for dipping. Any mom would love, even if it's just one of these dishes, even if you just found one of these dishes that intrigued you, go ahead and make it for her. So this show is very important to me. I've got some incredible women in my life. I would love to dedicate this show to my moms. My mom, Nancy, who's actually here with me today, she is doing all the dishes when you aren't looking. So I'm very blessed to have a mom who is my best friend and I hope to celebrate her on that day because she deserves it. I also have an incredible stepmom, Joan, who takes care of me and my kids as though we are her own and she is just a wonderful person. Also a little shout out to my mother-in-law in California who is a, a mother in love. She's just a wonderful woman as well and I am just so happy to celebrate these moms. All the moms out there, you deserve to be celebrated. I see you, I see the work you put into everyone around you and you deserve to have a day where someone else cooks, someone else cleans and feel all the love from everybody. I'd love to thank my sponsors. Of course, Gather on Broadway, best event venue, I can say that, in town, and uh, who does a wonderful Mother's Day brunch as well. And then after that, don't forget, we've got our wonderful Wyoiga Star Dairy, who su supplied the cheese that's so delicious. Also, Pelkin Smoky Meat. They have so many different kinds of bacon. Go try all their bacon. And what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna dig into all of this. I'm gonna have my mom come and join me when uh, the camera's off and she's gonna help me eat all this food because she deserves it. So everyone enjoy your Mother's Day and I hope to see you very soon. Don't forget these recipes are at wearegreenbay.com. You can also find it on the flow code that's been going through to scan it on your phone. And happy Mother's Day to all the moms out there. Take care everybody.